Hello, we're busy power gamers, and welcome back to another accessibility first look. This week, we're looking at Phantom Brave for the PC. Uh, I've talked about it before. I'll say it again. I'm so glad they're bringing some of these old games uh, and putting them on Steam. Uh, back in the day, it's been back in the day, it's been a while back. Uh, when I used to play consoles, we had this game on PlayStation and I loved it. Um, now I can't do consoles anymore, so uh, when I saw this on Steam, I was like, oh, I wonder if I can play it. Uh, and, you know, there was some debate on the movement, I didn't know. So I was like, you know, Steam so I'm just going to pick it up and I'm going to check it out and let you guys know too. So, let's look at the settings. Alright, settings, pretty standard. We got sliders, uh, character filter, one, two, off, I don't know what that is. You can change Japanese, English, next page. Windowed mode, yay! Um, it started out in full screen if I remember correctly. Maybe not, but as you can see, you can get it in windowed mode. Super quick, super easy. Um, it's got the old user interface, interface, or the new one. Key configuration. You can pick if you want to use a gamepad or a keyboard. Alright, now it's got want buttons. And if you click the button, you can rebind it. I'm going to put it back to W because I'm just going to. Uh, switch targets, you can tab, so you can keep the, all the stuff. You can move the camera. You go to the menu, you can cancel, confirm. And uh, that's, that, that's all these things. But you can remap them. Back. Gamepad. I mean, we can do gamepad. I don't know that much about gamepad, so. Um, I'm assuming you can read my please. Yes, you can. Okay. Oh, oh no. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Can I do this? No. Okay, there we go. Uh, you can remap the keypad too. And you can change everything. Just like you can the the default. And those are the settings. Can we exit? I'm totally hitting the wrong thing on Oh, testing done. Yes, Morona. Alright, and I right quick to exit. Alright, so Hitting you and see what happens because there were no subtitles. And I'm anxious to see if it has some, aren't you? The Island of Evil. Sounds like a fun place. Alright, here we go. Phantom Brave. <laughs> oh. Yeah. His name is Ash. No. They keep coming. How many are there? All right. Now it says to press K. If you left click, right. it advances. We should get out of here. Ta da! Come on, guys, this way! Oh, she is very excited. I'm just left clicking to advance the uh, text. I'm not having to use an on-screen keyboard, but it could because it's windowed. <laughs> Alright. I can't remember if this was a long intro. I did it too. I hope it isn't. I'm sorry, guys. Any ideas, Ash? Okay. Just one. Alright. Get Jasmine somewhere yeah. safe. Let's get Jasmine safe. I'll handle these guys. Alright, he's gonna handle it. And by he, uh, it probably we'll means no we. For her sake. I will not fail! Alright, everything's voice acted. Everything's got text, too. Uh, 
All right. So, here we go. All right. Uh, it's telling us how to work the thing. Ready? What's at the top where it gets to go first? Yes, 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 yes. Okay. We just wonder if we use a mouse. I ask the same. Look at there. Look at me for remembering something. All right. All right. Let, let's move our characters. To move your character, select the destination with the cursor. Okay. Red line around the character is this range of movement. Okay. It says to use arrow buttons to move it. And then press K. We're going to see if we actually have to do that. Pretty sure we do not. Okay, so we want to move him. Oh, it's going to do it for us, I guess. Okay, you can cancel while pressing L. Okay. Can we do it now, please? Okay. Alright, you can tab between targets. Okay, attack, strike. Again, it's doing everything for us. Alright. This is only a wounded game. Yeah. I know you can do it for me. I want to see if the mouse can do it. Come on. Okay. Should we do it now, please? Oh, come on, it's been a brave. I know how to do this. <laughs> yeah, if we need help, we'll do that. Okay. Okay, now can I go? Alright, so... See my mouse? Cursor moving? I'm just moving it! Yay! Alright, I can click on the ground. And it opens the menu to move. I can right click to cancel. So I'm not even having to use my on-screen keyboard. But again, I could if I had to. Although when you mouse over the edge to get to your on-screen keyboard, uh, you kind of go off the map. But it's okay, because look. Click him, and that releases my mouse. And I can go and click attack. And click strike. And go do it. Looky there, mouse only. Yeah. Okay. Uh, no, we can't move. Uh, I want to do that. Can I kill him? Oh, I guess I have to move. We're gonna stand on his head. Oh, okay, right click. Right click and it brings up the, um, menu. Okay, good to know. Alright, end action, I guess. We're just gonna stand on this monster's head, because why not? It's our turn again, alright. We're gonna attack him. With strike. Right. Right there. Nope. Right. Oh. Oh. Right there. <coughs> yeah. Kitty Mash. Alright, end action. And looky there, it's our turn again. Look at me, you killing the right monster. Attack. Strike. Attack. <laughs> Alright, so I did that whole thing with my left and right mouse buttons and the cursor. And, okay, get this guy some phantoms hurt, okay, do you want to join up? I don't want to read all this, I want you guys to. So I'm not going to, like, really read this. I'm going to just kind of do, 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 do. <laughs> this is why I don't like doing RPGs with you guys. Some games you just need to play for yourself, you know, or watch somebody play. I get that, but I mean once you get tired, you don't like, you know, the settings like I do. Alright, no, okay. Alright, we got people, people are party. I'm gonna create more party members. Press K to speak tomorrow. 
And we can recruit more phantoms. And talk to him if we need help. Okay. Uh, if you want to travel to other islands, that's a mailbox. You know, if we can save. Yep, we're going to see if we can do that in a second. As soon as we get control. Oh! Okay, there we go. I right click, it opens the menu, I can save. I right click off of it, it goes away. Hold down your left mouse button and move the cursor to run! Yay! Look at here! I think we have a mouse on the game. It looks that way to me so far. I see that, and there'll probably be like something that, um, pops up that you actually have to use the keyboard, but right now, not so much. Oh. Yeah, yeah, we want to do that. Save. Okay. The possessed. Okay. Yeah, okay, okay, we're good. We're good. Stop, stop saving. Population 550. Alright, let's see about talking to the mailbox. Because that seems to be a thing. Shall we? Alright, I just clicked down here at the bottom of the mailbox and this opened. Again, all mouse friendly. And we can run around with our mouse. So this is Phantom Brave. Um, I, I, I liked this game back in the day. Although I can't really remember that much about it because it's been so long. But I remember I liked it. Um, but yeah, right click, left click, I'm moving, I'm fighting, everything's going well. But don't take my word for it, it's on Steam. Go check it out, and if you have it, let me know what you think about it. If you played it back in the day, let me know what you think about it. Um, I'm excited about this one. I'm probably more excited than I should be. Uh, but it's good to see it back and playable again. Oh, I love it. Alright, so, leave me comments. Let me know what you think about the game. As always, if you want to see more of this type of content, subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, AbilityPower.com. Uh, we have a Patreon if you'd like to help support us. Uh, Patreon is what pays for hosting and the games that we test and everything. It goes to good use. Uh, thanks to the patrons we already have. If you would like to become one, the link is in the description below. And we'll see you next time on Ability Powered.